Hey there guys, I know I'm uh, one day late, but today we have the uh, Season 10 update in Fortnite Battle Royale. So I guess uh, let's check it out. But also just like the note, uh, looking at these challenges, they all just seem to be just playing the game, which are very nice. Uh, I love to see them make things easier for people to uh, level up in the uh, Battle Pass. And uh, I don't know if you can tell, but I am very tired. I just woke up, because this is like the only time I can really play for a bit. Because yesterday, aka Thanksgiving, it was... This day I had to go to work, which sucks. I was working all day. And uh, I have time this morning to play, so you know. But, uh, oh no. My my game just my game just crashed. Okay. Alright. Let's give that one more shot. Alright, I don't know what I was saying uh, before. About something about Thanksgiving. But yeah, this is my only time I can really play during this Thanksgiving break. In the mornings, so very tired so I want to be able to get this video up as soon as possible so you know just looking at the mini map uh, we, the hot spots are back it's pretty nice I'm probably gonna try to drop at the meteor though I used to love dropping meteor and then dusty divot or dusty depot I'd always do that back in season X that or tilted town those are my two season X uh, drops that weren't junk junction so now they added starry suburbs which is really cool for my rotation because instead of going right here I'd rotate to Starry, then to Pleasant, instead of that to like Loot Lake or whatever. This glider doesn't look that bad with my edit star right now. This combo looks pretty nice. You know, this weekend we have the uh, tournament for the Umbrella version of this, the competitor's time umbrella. But I have work, which sucks. Which means this is going to be like the one Fortnite OG cosmetic I'm not going to be able to get. Unless if... Flint knock. So this thing. Oh, junk rifts are back. Oh! Yeah, I was saying, unless if I uh, switch region regions, which I don't know if that's still a thing, so I'm pretty sure they tried to add like a bin on it. Oh, did I? Am I the only one up here? Let's go. What? I forgot how cool the uh, meteor was. But the low gravity. Remember, you could hide in here. Nobody it would be a card for people to see you. The effects are sick. All right. Time for me to, I guess, hop down to Dusty. Yeah, because I want to check out the meteor, or not the meteor, the rocket, because that's uh, in its final stage right now. And we got planes. Oh, there's a rift down there right next to the meteor. That's pretty funny. Probably for to help no build players. I remember back in season X, I would try to uh, try to sky base up there, build up there from the ground, and that was a just death sentence every single time. I also want to check out the ballers because. I remember I saw on Twitter when they first dropped today, or yesterday, they had like a 1% drop rate, but now it's back to 100. So now they're like everywhere. Where they're supposed to be at least. <gasps> Storm flips! Oh, this is so cool. I like didn't play much of Season 9 when these were in the game, so it's really cool how I'm going to be able to experience these again. I'm pretty excited for this live event. Even th Oh, and Chug Splashes are back. That's pretty cool. But... Yeah, I hope Chapter 5 is put on a smaller team to work on the game, but a smaller team who's like more passionate about Fortnite, so then the, uh, you know, the, the shareholders or those people can care more about, uh, what's it called, the new game modes that they're making, I think that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, see this is a little piece of lore, I'm gonna listen to that, then I'll be right back. You know, this all this lore is just kind of stupid because I, I probably mentioned this in a different video. It just feels so everywhere. The last time the lore was good was in like, I don't know, chapter three, season two, probably. But I, I wouldn't say it was like good. I was just like, I, I, under, I somewhat understood what was going on. Like, I think the last good part of the lore was like the season six with that, that alive event that was like, Single player. 
that was cool. But I hope, yeah, I just hope next season, once Fortnite goes all oh, baller, that is so fast. I just hope when Fortnite gets all, you know, Robloxy, they have smaller teams devoted to each game mode. Oh, there's a baller. And each one of those teams care very passionately about whatever they're working on, which means like, oh, creative people care a lot about how creative turns out. Uh, Battle Royale, Lego, all this stuff. Why is there like a little fuel charge on this? The guy here. Over there. Oh, that did not make it. Five tick, yikes. I don't know where to go from here, if I'm being completely honest. Those are airstrikes? Whoa! Yikes. Alright. Let's give this one more shot. I find it so weird how Fortnite just randomly switched to the, uh new item shop design like halfway through this season like i understand why they did it because they weren't making any money with that tiny item shop but now it just kind of feels like it's a mess it's like half the season they're going for like oh the og gimmick now it's you know fortnite gimmick i don't know like the modern fortnite if that's what you want to call it this combo is so cool by the way i just want to keep mentioning that this i just made this on a whim i mean the pickaxe can sometimes change to red but this is such a nice combo, especially with the back bling and uh, skin. Also, something else really weird, because I know when the first season first dropped, I was like, talking about how much I liked it. You know, I, I am pretty sure this is the one season I've wanted to end faster than any other season. Like, all the excitement kind of dropped off after, like, the first week, in my opinion. And now it's like, I just kind of want to get to a new map and stop. Uh, I guess. So I want Fortnite to stop just trying to focus on, I guess, nostalgia in terms of how to get their player base back. Oh yeah, also that's when uh, Kevin and the Zero Points are together now. Uh, I got a really bad drop. I might land here. I'm landing here. Nobody seems to be going here. Yeah, I want Fortnite. I don't know. For some reason, Fortnite is a thing with making every single season one weirdly good, and I hope Chapter 5 is no exception. So I just hope Chapter 5 Season 1 is very memorable, just like Chapter 3 and 4. Oh, the drum shotgun's back. That's pretty cool. I haven't really looked much into the patch notes. And the airstrike. Where is this guy? Wow, they really thought they got me. Well, how far does this go? Okay. Jug jug. Is that gliding? Whatever. Oh, there's new effects on the ground. I don't know that. That. That's cool. I didn't, I didn't know that was a thing. I know when we had the bottomless chug jug, it'd make effects like on your screen, but that's that's cool. Why would somebody just abandon the bush? The bush is just one free hit. Oh, so something I'm curious about. I know you can't bounce off of Kevin anymore. Will this rift you to the sky? No? Wow. That is weird. Let's get rid of all like the silly little effects. 
I really don't like how the map has become more and more inaccurate to OG Fortnite throughout the uh, season updates. Like, I'm very upset with season seven. I it, it sucks how the jungle is in here. Neo tilted Neo or Mega Mall, the uh, rift events. Like, I don't know. Like, there was no harm in adding Starry Suburbs, and they just chose not to. I think that's a missed opportunity. Because they could easily just add more little POIs that, like, don't replace others, and it'll be cool. Also, I just want to shoot one of these down. There, there we go. Same, same old stuff, I guess. I want to try to ruin this build fight. I'm going to try to go in the house below it. Like this. Then just throw one, two, three. Five tick in the storm is wild. I just wanted to uh, point that out. Oh, this dude had like actually such a NPC loadout, but I like it. Just a purple shotgun, blue AR, RPG, and some grapplers. I wanna have, I wanna find the ballers again. I want a better excuse to use the ballers. It's sad to admit, I have never really played this season solo. I always end up playing with friends. Ah! That's embarrassing. If I die to her, I will cry. Okay, I guess I'm not crying tonight. I can't believe I RPG'd myself. That was embarrassing. Dude, how did she end up getting a spaz? Got a great that's probably an NPC, probably a bot. Oh the, the effect on the ground is like less visible now. Also, if you're watching this the day this video is going up, uh I'm pretty sure the Invincible Collabs drop in the item shop tonight. Which is uh pretty exciting. You know, we got Invincible, the crew pack, and then Eminem. Then I have every single Fortnite OG cosmetic, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Except for the competitor's time umbrella, because I'm not going to be able to get that because I've got work. As I said earlier today. Unless I'm able to somehow switch regions. I remember when I tried doing it for this glider. The, the not umbrella one. The queue times were so sad. Like it was like 30 minutes to get in one game. And then... Uh, it's a rift event. 30 minutes for one game and then... Uh, I would die off rip. It wasn't fun. And also, I'm pretty sure in the leaks they were going to have different types of rift events, like for the kinetic weapons. Oh, that guy scared me. But I guess we're only having the grappler now. I wonder, does my deal damage quest count for this? So if I'm 30 meters... So I know it would work for some NPCs back in the day. It does. That is somewhat useful to know. Because deal damage for more than 30 meters. I never like using long range weapons. That's where he came from. That guy confused me. Buddy, what are you doing? I ain't stopping, buddy. Someone sounds cracked. You son of a.
Oh, let's go. Jetpacks. That's awesome sauce. Chug jug. This game loves me right now. You know, when I finally abandoned doing my skin gameplay videos, skin showcase videos, the games I've been playing, I've actually been doing decent at. It's just insane. And not bot lobbies, because these have been real people. I shouldn't know what I want to give up. For heals. Oh, I'm not taking heals. I should get rid of my grappling hook, because I already have the uh, jetpack for mobility. I hate how ugly the zero point looks. I mean, I understand it's like supposed to be vulnerable right now, but I think it looked really cool and it had like the cracks and stuff. There's somebody here. Are they in the cave? Is the cave in the oh, yeah. minigun? I'm taking the minigun. I haven't had a chance to play with the minigun yet. I thought they got. I, I, I thought they just forgot to add the minigun. Given how I just never found it. Unless if it was added in this update. But I thought it was going to be added in uh, last week's update. Hey, buddy. Oh. Oh, hey. Thank you. Golden tack. I got a scar. I'm getting rid of the minigun for the scar. The scar is like... I'm getting rid of the jetpack. I'm not going to use it. Bouncers. I keep forgetting traps are back. I never seem to use them. Traps? Honestly, the removal of traps are probably a good thing. Given how little I see people use them. People only started to really complain about them once they were actually removed. But I feel like the removal of traps just kind of tidies up the loop pool in my opinion. Travel distance with pickaxe equipped. I didn't even know that was a challenge. I, I don't like read any of these. That's such an easy one. Or they're not called challenges. They're called what? Quests? Yeah. Drift boards. Oh, this is so cool. I, I want to show you guys. You probably already know of it. But I love doing this. I love, I love, you know, I call it edging. But I love edging. Look at this. It's so cool. If I die, I'll be so sad. Pretty much. Since driftboards, they don't actually touch the surface of anything, really. Unless if you, like, go really hard. Yep. They float on the water. So you can see the death barrier right there. Uh, Yeah, you can just kind of float on the edge. And now you got to go back in. But I thought it was pretty neat. And I'm... But I gotta show you this. And we're top five. There we go. Oh no. <gasps> I'm dead. Ah oh, man, I'm that is embarrassed. That was such a stupid way to go out. I could have easily just uh Went to the rift, but I thought I could make it up. I'm sorry about that disappointing loss, guys. I'm sorry. Sorry about that unsatisfying conclusion to this video. But you know, yeah, overall, I prefer this update over, you know, last season update. Because it actually is more, more accurate, I guess, to how the season was, you know, with the meteor. Which, that was about it. Without, like, you know, because if they wanted to make it completely accurate, they'd get rid of stuff, which is something they're not going to do. But that's me for this video. If you like supporting this uh, in the front of Adam shop, my code is shygalo56. Yeah, see you guys in the next video. I don't know if I'm going to make another video between this and the live events, but either way, I'll see you then.